Alrighty. Nev, start off round three. Anybody got Sorry. anything that can trip them? Huh. Yeah, it's funny you should say that. Anyway. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. You did. So fluffing plants. <laughs> okay, so Nev is going to move here. Mm-hmm. And she is going to attack with her dagger. All right. Dagger. That's a bold strategy there. Yeah. Well, we do what we can. Imagine having a weapon. Uh, that does not hit. They go. Uh, the first one on the deer, on the stag. Oh, it goes stag for eight points of damage. He just wants to kill that deer. This is what this whole combat is about. What do you the other one goes. Get the deer out of there, dude. Twenty-five to hit Nikolai. Oh, good gosh. For seven points of subdual damage. I don't know what that means. That uh, that's non-lethal. Die. Yeah. So I'm at two hit points. Yep. But you will get the hit points back at a rate of X amount per hour. Constog. Uh, yeah, sure. Can I near one of the only things that can actually fight this thing out of there? Sure. Okay. Uh, what do you want to do? Uh, What's your weapon, Comstock? My deer. <laughs> uh, uh, gonna have the eagle on the back attack. Okay. Okay. Why do I do that? Uh, slash R D R uh, slash R D twenty plus three. And you roll two of those. So if you press the up arrow, you can get it to roll it again. Uh, and then a third one for its bite. Ooh, that will hit. Roll me a D four. Oh man. <laughs> All right. Where do you want to put the other one? I copied this right. Uh, maybe I didn't. Oh no, I did. You got. You should have control of it. Uh, can I? What is it called when you like retreat? Withdraw? withdraw. Yeah. Can I withdraw my deer? Uh, your deer didn't it make an attack? No. Okay. Then yeah, I can choose to it withdraw. Make, yeah, I'm going to. Withdraw it back here, and okay. then I'm going to put the eagle where it was. Okay. So the two eagles. Are there. All right. Uh, the eagle can then make an attack. So give me another D3, or D20 plus three. Get a uh, for a hit. To death, huh? Roll me a D4. Oh, come on. Roll twenty is just not being as good as it usually is. I'm enjoying the music, however. Nikolai, thank you. Oh, um, oh sorry, Constog, what were you doing as your, uh, uh, your action? Can I uh, summon one more nature's ally? Sure, same thing. Yeah, get one more eagle out there. All right. Bird oh. powers activate. All right, Nikolai. G-force. It acts immediately, though. That Doesn't the eagle do something? Does it say that? Yeah, it says the summit ally appears where you designate and act. It has a full eagle. round casting time, though. Okay, so that means not till next turn. Correct. Um, so I want to use true strike before I hit. Is that ooh? Q uh, yeah, you can. So as a magus, um, you can both That's... cast a spell and attack. Uh, so you need to make either a concentration check to cast it defensively, um, or you can you take an attack of opportunity from this thing, and if it hits, you'll need to make a save or lose the spell. I don't know which of those is better to do. Uh, depends on whether or not you think you're gonna get a hit. I mean, you have two hit points right now. Yeah. I, it, you don't want to get hit. <laughs> yeah. So what if I do it defensively? What does it do? You make a concentration check, and if you don't beat DC, I think it's 15 plus the spell's level, you lose the spell. 
So then what's even the point of using it? Because I'm probably going to lose it. Uh, you're taking an opportunity that you might not have to otherwise hit this thing? I don't know. You tell me. I mean, I'm not the person playing the character. I'm the person playing the enemies. You're the person that actually knows how these things work. I don't even see concentration on my... Concentration is on your spell section. Uh, right above your spells per day. All right, you can successfully cast the spell. Go ahead and click that true strike. There Ooh, it is. And go ahead and make your attack with a plus 20. I'm not ready to go. All right, that's not a botch, so that is a hit. Roll me a d6 finally. plus your strength modifier. All right, we're use, you're using a set scimitar, right? Yeah. All right, d6 plus your strength damage. How do I roll again? Slash R space D6 plus whatever your strength bonus is. So I think it's five. Uh, for oh. six points of damage. Wow. Oh, one. Great. Well, still something. You're our best hit so far. All right, Trent. All right, I'm uh, moving in and attacking with the seagull. Okay. Does a zero hit? What? <laughs> <laughs> it, 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 hit, it doesn't hit, but it apparently breaks roll 20. No, I, uh, okay, so uh, so for on this, uh, for the crit range, uh, am I supposed to put two or 18 if it's a... Or a you should put yeah. 18. Okay. I wasn't sure. I had okay. 18, and I was like, wait, does that mean I have a crit range of 18? No. Or... So I wasn't sure. Okay, so that's that's just what it was with my crit range. Oh, was up there. Erasmus. All right. Uh... Lead your party! Yeah, I'm going... Whatever. Uh... All right, so I'm looking out at our uh, things there. Um, who looks like they're in the most trouble? Uh, uh, Nikolai, give me a, give me a perception, or I'm sorry, give me a sense motive, because you can, I'm, you can clearly see what's happening. So give me a sense motive. And I gave a plus two to it due to some trade I accidentally took. Yep. Ooh, uh, you're not sure. You, the one thing you assume is that uh, uh, Nikolai is probably in some trouble. Okay, uh, I'm going to help Nikolai, wrongly. And uh, uh, I'll just spell power and nothing. Okay. I'm, I'm desperate enough to try one of these exploits. Okay. Spell. Okay, so they don't have a mind. Okay. Hold on, I'm, I'm trying to read this damn thing. Yeah, that would allow you to raise your caster level for something like, I don't know, magic missile to a three. Okay, we'll do it. All right, that would give you two magic missiles. Roll me up 2d4 plus two. So R, 2d4 plus two? R space 2d4 plus two, d4 plus two.
Up oh, slash. Right? I'm sorry, slash R. If you press the up arrow, you can edit it by going over to the R and putting the slash in front of it. The slash underneath the question mark. Okay. Or eight. Right. Your magic missiles fly and impact this thing quite impressively. And it looks more damaged than it has been the entire combat. Yes. Yeah. Maybe we can knock out the one. Okay, so and then get is... killed by the other. <laughs> Niev is gonna take a five step back. Mm-hmm. And she is going to cast Cure Light Wounds on Nikolai. Okay. Nikolai, heal three. Thanks. All right. I can. This one's going to bring it down on a bird. Oh, no. A hit. For eight, I think that takes it out. Uh, yep, there are five apiece. Boom, one bird down. And the next on Nikolai. 16 against Nikolai? You go with the intro. Yeah, that's exactly right. No, Nikolai, not Trent. Okay. Oh, not that much damage. Uh, for eight. That puts me at negative three. All right, you are unconscious. Fuck. Constog. Oh. Mm. Uh, Y'all are screwed well. now. I'm Ooh. going to send in the new bird to flank the other bird. Okay. And it's going to attack. All right. Give me four d uh four d twenty plus threes. Uh, one hits, two hits. Ooh. It does not confirm. Uh, third one hits, and give me one more. All right, so three hits. Roll 3d4 plus. Just roll 3d4. Peck him to death. Get him, my avian children. <laughs> Ooh, it's this is looking really bad. Really heavily beat up. Uh, Nikolai, oh, you're unconscious. Wait, wait, oh yeah, I'm sorry. Both of the birds or both of the birds? That was both of the birds. Because it's three from the one and one from the other. Uh... Yeah, I forgot about Khan's dog's action and the stag's action. I don't know what Iron the Stag could really do. Unless you want to, I mean, unless you want to try to gore. Wait, did we skip it. over me? I should have went after Nikolai, right? Uh, you. It's not Nikolai yet. I didn't go. I just got knocked out. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, but you'll get up again. Okay. In we'll several see. hours. I intend to fully keep him down. Thanks. All right, what are you doing? Three. Uh, two. I think I'm just going to wait. Okay. Erasmus. All right. I I'm sorry, Trent. Hold on, Trent. Cool. I accidentally hit the skip button too many times. So, so this thing's knocked out, it looks like? No, this thing's still up. It's just in bad shape. Oh, so... But she didn't have the birds attack it for some reason? She did have the birds attack it. That's how it ended up in bad shape. There were literally five D20 rolls that were rolled by her for the birds. Uh, so do do I know this thing is dealing subdual damage? Like, am I? You have not been hit by it, so you but, don't know. But but the stag next to me was getting hit by it. And the stag um, talks what language? Stag? No, I mean, this, this is why I was asking, is if it was something I could tell by sight. Okay, you can't so tell by sight. So I would withdraw over to Nikolai to try and okay. beat him up. All right, no problem. So you withdraw over. Yeah. All right, Erasmus. 
Fuck it. Uh, all right, I'll break out my quarter staff because I'm out of spouse. Okay. You gonna charge it? Yeah. All right, give me an attack roll. I'll move you in for the charge. I'm living my truth. Okay. Three. That is a miss. It is a super miss. Nev. Okay. So can I do like a heal roll to do first aid on um, Nikolai to try and stabilize him? Sure. Give me a heal check. It's what heal does best. Uh, oh my god, so Nikolai cool. might be dying. Oh god. <laughs> so, okay, so I would be unable then to do first aid. Yes. Okay. Um, was that my standard action? Or that was your standard action, action. yep. Uh, okay. Standard action to administer first aid. Are, are you saying as like a free action Nikolai would be dying or anything? <laughs> okay, so um, I, I guess I would be... I would say, I would be like, oh my god, he's dying. Like, over at uh, Trent, like, do something. And that'll be my turn. Okay. Oh lord, he's dying. This one's going to move over, and it's going to attack Niev. For 16 to hit. Uh, yes. For 8 points of damage. And the one on Constag's bird. Hits for eight. Down goes another bird. Jeez. Oof. Uh, Constag. Um, can my deer charge? Yes. Yes, it can. You know, what they do. Almost down. Let's, let's, let's charge this thing. All right. Yeah. That is a hit. It's looking worse. And the bird's oh, gonna hit up. Yep. 3d20. Plus three. Miss. That's a hit. That's a hit. Roll me 2d4. You might take it out. Just two. Oh, whoops. That's all right. It's still up, but it looks like it's barely functioning. Oh, for fuck's sake. Nikolai. I'm down, remember? Yep. Trent. Uh, stabilize. All right. Uh, you stabilize the potentially dying Nikolai. Erasmus. <laughs> All right. Uh, Can you do it? This thing is. This thing looks like it's in a, a great state of disrepair. Come on. I believe I got nothing. I suck it first. I thought you could smack it. That's what I'm gonna do. I just can't hit. Not that I can't hit. Come on! Don't you have a twenty strength? A hit! Roll me that damage. All right. Uh, uh, quarter staff, right? D6? Yeah. Plus your strength bonus or minus your strength bonus? I believe I actually, I actually did not give myself a negative strength bonus. All right. So D6. Six. All right. This thing shakes and then like hunches over. Oh, God. Niev. Uh. Okay, so Niev is pretty hurt, and so she is going to withdraw. Okay. And try to move as, as much away as she can back towards Constog. Okay. Take Nikolai with you. <laughs> Boy, I just got a screen full of, uh, I just got a screen full of rolls. How very weird. That is weird. All the stabilized rolls 
the stabilized roll, a bunch of rolls, they all just populated in my screen. Yeah, roll 20 has been a little laggy for me. I, it might just be something up with it. Anything else after you retreat? Uh, withdrawing is a... Actually, if you withdraw, you can't take another action. And you're, it's a full round action. Okay, so. that's that's all I do then. Uh, the other one is going to go, and it is going to move in. And it is going to attempt to beat up Trent. Does a 14 hit Trent? It does not. All right. <laughs> Uh, and that will take us to Constog. All right. If, this, if the other one's not moving, we're going to move our animal friends. Yay, animal friends! Uh, have, have I seen Trent attack something? Nope. Yeah. I oh, yeah, you did. You attacked dagger. next to the, yeah, yeah. he attacked okay. with a dagger next to the, the other one. That is correct. Sorry. Everybody has gotten a chance to attack. It's been fun. And I crit on my two. <laughs> you crit on your zero, sir. Into flanking with Trent. All right. Oh. Uh, and that's under its movement speed, so it can make an attack. It can turn as part of that. Since it has average movement speed. That is a hit. Oops, I keep doing that. It's okay. So we'll take the first one. Okay. Yay! And Gorin. Yeah. Nikolai is down. Trent. Yes, surprisingly. All right, so I mean, I saw it not go after Nikolai when Nikolai was down. It was Correct. after me, so I'm yep. gonna I'm gonna go ahead and attack then. All right. I'm not, I'm not gonna worry about dragon. Dragon Nikolai out like I was. I don't think you could. That is a miss. Erasmus. Hey, that, that, I got a plus two for flanking. <laughs> You're not flanking. Oh no, you are. I'm sorry. With the I'm, bird, yeah. I was thinking that I, I was thinking the stag. I don't know why for a second I thought you were the stag. <laughs> Can I move into position where I'm flanking with the stag? Uh no. Currently Trent is flanking with the stag. I'm not flanking with the bird. With the bird. No, he's flanking I'm, with the bird. You can you can move into a position, but it will take you. Uh, 70 feet of movement. Damn. Well, I'm going to move over to the other guy and attack. Okay. 70 feet of movement, shit. Do you want to charge or do you want want to just attack? No, I'll charge. All right. Give me that charge attack. So plus two is a 14, which will sadly miss. Damn. I, I, I do the, uh, for the... I'm going to quote uh, Bill Cavalier. For the fury of the fig and flower. All right. Nev. All right. So seeing that they have the uh, clockwork thing, you know, at least engaged, then she's going to go back towards uh, Trent and offer him guidance. Okay. He needs it. Minus two attacks. Well, this is going to well, attack Trent. Zero now. Oh, wrong You're spell, fine. sorry. <laughs> Trent does an 18 hit. Trent. Yeah. For 10 points of damage. All right, yeah, that's going to knock me out. Oh, well, that gun guy. really helped. Constog. Um. Constog, you're the hero of this fucking operation. Is our professor just like standing around twiddling his thumb? He's standing, yeah. watching excitedly. Ugh. I hate this guy. A jerk face. <laughs> I, I'm, I'm, just, I'm just gonna attack this thing. Okay. I'm gonna start with the bird, since that was the most rolls to deal with. So, how many rolls? Three. Have, Have the bird hit. Oh, whoops, sorry. Hit and or no, I'm sorry, just one hit. So just one d4. Make it a four. It is a four. Look at that. All right, next and up. Be zero. Okay. Going to hit. Damn. 
Let's hear it for the animals. Yeah, a hot animal dice. Rest in peace. Wait, that phrasing? <laughs> Constock. <laughs> I, I hope that I they're that they're not that sort of animal companion. <laughs> See, I don't think there's really anything I myself. Okay. Uh, Nikolai Squirt Squirt, Percival Squirt Squirt, and Erasmus. All right. Uh, can I go? Uh, which one am I, Steve? I, I I can't get my glasses right today. Uh, you are to the right of, uh, the deer. The stag. Okay, so can I move into flanking with any of these many animals? No, you can move five feet towards a, towards a potential, like, maybe one day flank. Okay, let's do that. Alright, so flank. you step over and yeah. make your attack. This is the most I've attacked in this game, in any of these games. <laughs> Oh no! Uh, that bad six, huh? Yeah. Niev. Is it possible to give the animals guidance? It is. Okay. It is in the hundred percent. You can step over and give an animal some guidance. I'm going to give the stag guidance. All right, and this thing's gonna try to take down the stag. Uh. Everything Eleven. Much dies. Nope. Constog. Like oh, I gotta do one more thing uh, to it. Hold on. Gets its healing. Ugh. Constog. Can, can my can my deer five foot step? Yeah. Uh, we're gonna have a five foot step so that it's flanking the bird. Okay. <laughs> it's standing on top of uh. Uh. He doesn't care. What Trent? He's just gonna attack Brain. the thing. All right. Let's see it. Uh, oh, right here, so. Oh, nope. God bless America. <laughs> Still got a bird. And then the bird's going to attack. Actually, how many bird? How many rounds is the bird in play? I think the bird was gone. Oh, is it? How many rounds per level is it? Uh, or is it minutes per level? Oh, it is one round per level. Oh, that thing's been way gone. Oh, frick. All right. Well, the ghost bird disappears. Ah, uh, shucks. You hear a lot. And it actually way. turns out this thing hasn't been damaged nearly as much. Uh, I hate this thing. All right. Well, people will need to be withdrawn. Erasmus. All right. Uh, fuck it. Uh... Eat my staff, you ugly son of a bitch. Did it go through? It did. That is a miss. All right. Niev. Don't eat my staff. Niev uh, thinks that it's probably a very good idea that we withdraw that Erasmus was right all along. Um, can she try and put Trent over the stag? Uh, sure. Give me a strength check. She's also, she's also, like, clearly saying that she thinks that we should withdraw. All right, yeah, with a burst of, like, heroic energy, you hoist Trent onto the stag. How does the stag handle this? <laughs> we'll, we'll see how the stag handles this. Does a 17 hit the stag? Jeez. Yes. For nine points of damage on the stag. Uh, how does how does the stag handle that? Oh, uh, considering it's now at a negative four. All right. Oh. Constag. also down now. Constag, your ghost birds have disappeared. Your stag has fallen unconscious. What do you do? Get the stag out of here. It can't. Oh. It's down. Let me go pick it up and carry it over. Oh, <laughs> wait. Trent's on top of it now. Constag, what do you do? I don't know, leader. What are we supposed to do? Well, you're gonna. I told everybody to start withdrawing. Look how well that worked out. Do you withdraw? Um, I think Ellen the leader can say for sure, 
but yeah, start. I mean, I'm basically here, like in the hallway. Still. Sure, but you haven't withdrawn. Do you withdraw, or do you keep going, Get or do you stand where you're at? What do you do? I mean, there's not really anything else I can do, so. So you stand there? Yeah. Go! Okay. Go! I oh, start wait. yelling, go! Go! If he's gonna yell at me, then fine. I'll go. Okay. Alright, who is that? Uh, the there is a whistle that goes off. Your team has officially withdrawn. Your combat is complete. Uh, good work, clerics. Get out there. Uh, the machines will. The, this machine will move over here, Ugh. and it will. He was just pretending. It will fix the other machine. machine. Anyway. Okay, go for it. Give me an attack roll on it. I, I'm not going. To. Okay. Uh, this machine then fixes the other machine, and they move back into their positions. Um, and you all can watch as party after party after party is defeated. Um, most of them do not do as effectively as your party does end up doing in this combat. Um, it did not feel very effective. It was you very did not effective. did have a great round. It was, um, it was because of the ghost. The story. true strike was pretty cool, though. At the end, back at class, the professor will explain the, the situation. Wait, are we revived or? Yeah. Oh, absolutely. Yeah, he said. Clerics. He said there were clerics that will that come in, uh, they heal you, and bring you back out. I thought that it was just the two machines healing each other. Nope. Um. That was terrible. You were not expected to win that battle. Some of you stayed in for much longer than you likely should have. Had this been a real dangerous scenario, you would have lost allies. Some of you retreated far too quickly before you knew the threat at hand. You did not know your. You <laughs> totally wouldn't even did. take chances on your own skills, and instead fled immediately. Neither of these are positive options. Now, we will be doing this one more time, but I will give you all time to research and prepare. Oh. Not every time will you have the time to research and prepare, but leadership skills can change how things go. Learn what you learn. What you must learn. Figure out what you can do. You are being graded on the next one for how effective you perform and how much you accomplish. In the meantime, I'm handing out your grades for this assignment as you got it currently. Some of you did well, as I said, some of you need a lot of work. Um, and he lays down on your desk uh, a B minus. Yeah, oh, um, he, so he evaluates that well you did good work in combat um, when people started to fall you delayed far too long to start pulling people out um, you had already had one that was basically dead um, and you proceeded to push on further losing yet another one and then losing a party's companion um, uh, he does yeah. say that uh, he also grades negatively for Erasmus immediately saying everyone should run before anything had really happened. <laughs> I stand by that. <laughs> um, but otherwise, uh, yeah, it is a B minus to go along with the A minus that you received. We're still doing pretty good in this class. Still uh, at least averaging out to a C, so. Oh, good. So Lord. let's. Terrible. Let's hand out some XPs. Um, everybody I can. I got so excited to that event that I have to pee now. No problem. We're uh, we're finishing up now, so everybody can take. Um, let me see. This thing is that plus the normal. Uh, everybody can take seven hundred XP. Wow, we got three hundred last time. Does that put us at a grand? Yep. yep. And that includes the recap. And that includes the recap. Does my stag get XP? Your stag does not. Your stag levels as you level. Okay. That wouldn't that be cute? Because you know you'd end up with players with uh, animal companions that were, you know what I mean, like super powered because uh, they sucked and their animal companion was so much better. Just send the animal in to fight a bunch of balloon monsters and get little XP little by little <laughs> until they're like level twenty companions. 
That'd be so good. You know, one thing I, I don't miss about earlier editions, the different ski, the different uh, points to advance. Like it was so expensive to be a wizard. Mm -hmm. Nobody wanted to play one. All right. Well, I'm going to wrap up the stream. Uh, good night, everybody watching. Take care. Thank you so much.